Hi, I'm Bob Kovacs, and this is my review of the Sudafoto Softbox Attachment. It's a Bowens mount attachment that attaches onto the end of any Bowens mount device, any Bowens mount light. Now, in this case, I have a Sudafoto P80 light that has a Bowens mount attachment on the end of it, and I'll show you how the two mate together, but it's a standard Bowens mount accessory that will go on any Bowens mount device. It's a pretty common system in the film and television industry. Now this comes with a couple of accessories. Number one is a pretty nice carrying case. It's good heavy canvas. It's got padding inside of it and it's not just some cheap plastic. It's a good carrying case. Sudafoto, in my experience, has really nice carrying cases for its products. It also comes with a diffusion material that you can put around the perimeter and it attaches via hook and loop fasteners and it provides really nice soft light. And this is something that comes with it. Also, you have this occlusion disc that mounts in the middle and it's got an amber side and a silver side. Now, it attaches to these hook and loop tabs inside the scoop frame like this. And when I turned it on, I expected that when the light shined on the amber side, that it would create more amber light coming from the front of this. I tried it both amber side facing in and silver side facing in, and both ways, really what it did is it blacked out the center and gave a ring of light around the edge, kind of the same sort of effect that you would get with a ring light. This uses a standard Bowens mount, which has these three pips on this ring. It's really heavy duty. And these fit into the fitting on the light and then rotate until the blue button here clicks. Now that this is mounted, you need to pull the ribs out until they lock into place. And see this tab? You'll see that tab click when the rib locks into place. And the next one, and the next one, and just go all the way around, locking the ribs into place. Now that this is mounted on the light, how do we collapse it? Well, it's not hard, really. Undo everything, peel back these hook and loop fasteners. And what you need to do now is to pull back on the rib and press the tab to release each rib. and now you can collapse it. Once you get this open, it's about 22 and a half inches across or about 55 or 56 centimeters. Now you can use it just like this and it will be a light cannon that powers light out of it or Sudafoto provides a diffuser material that you can put onto this using the hook and loop fasteners that go all the way around this scoop. Now let's see what the light looks like in a couple different scenarios. So here's an example of, oh, perhaps a living room lighting setup. Now from your left-hand side of the screen, I've got daylight that's coming in a window, pretty strong daylight. It's a bright sunny day and the window's just a, a few feet away, maybe four feet away. And I have the Sudafoto light perhaps five feet away over here on your right side of the screen. And this is an example of how that light works out. And I think it looks pretty good. This is a test of using the Sudafoto P80 light with the softbox attached, using only the softbox as my only light. That's it, there's no other light in this room. So to demonstrate that, we're gonna go ahead and turn it off. So I'm still here, I'm in the darkness, there's a little bit of incidental light leaking around the window shades, but really the camera can't see me and the, there is no light here that the camera can pick up. So we're gonna turn the Sudafoto light back on and now you're getting me. Now the light is about seven and a half feet away. Let's call it about two and a half meters. And this is the light that I'm getting from that one light fixture. Now, if it was a little bit bigger, it probably would be a little bit better. There's a shadow under my chin here, not a terrible shadow, but there's only one light. So you can actually light somebody with only one light especially if you have some incidental light coming in from the sides. But again, I wanted to demonstrate what this was like using only one light.
So that's a look at the Sudafoto Bowens Mount Softbox. Keep in mind it has a Bowens Mount, which is a standard interface. So if you have lights with Bowens Mounts, you can easily attach this softbox to those lights. It has some really nice features. I love the look that you get with this diffusion material. The actual build quality is really sturdy. The accessories it comes with, the carrying case, are really meant to take a lot of wear and tear. So I am really appreciative that I have this. I expect to use it quite a bit. Now when you don't have this diffusion material in here, then you have a light cannon that makes a very broad, very powerful light, especially when you crank the, the energy level of the light up. It's just a very powerful light if you need to light a broad space. So it works out really well. I expect to be giving it a lot of use. Hey everybody, I'm Bob Kovacs. Thanks for watching.